Hi, I'm Carla Kay of Kay Contemporary Art in Santa Fe, New Mexico, sharing with you today the work of Rick Stevens. This new painting titled Emblazoned is probably the largest painting we have seen yet, and it is painted in uh, oil on canvas. Rick Stevens certainly enjoys hiking in nature, and you see that within his work, how much he loves the forest and how much he is inspired by the forest. As a young child in Spartan, Michigan, he would explore the forest with his father who would enjoy going out to paint plein air paintings. Now as an adult, Rick uh, brings that uh, joie de vivre of uh, that past of his ancestry into the work today and he's very much inspired when going out into nature. Isn't it great feeling the forest when looking at Rick Stevens paintings? He really captures that moment when the, the trees are almost having a dance with each other. It feels like you're entering a secret society of trees and, and their conversations with each other, using the wind to guide them in a new dance. Uh, this particular painting called Swaying uh, Trees in Autumn really does express that uh, movement in nature and it brings us into the wonderment of, of that particular moment of time when the light is glistening and the air is crisp and, and you just feel that moment. Rick Stevens spent a lot of time this year in our Santa Fe National Forest and set up his campsite near this beautiful stream and it became very inspiring to him. Uh, we're finding these streams that he's painted really do have a sense of movement and light play. I actually like the, this painting right next to me where he's chosen to make feature of the, the leaves and the dappled trees nearby uh, come into focus and the stream is slightly out of focus. Um, but still, you can almost hear the water pouring and uh, rushing through. Rick loves uh, his time meditating near the stream, and letting go is a great part of the meditation, listening to the sound of the water, allowing the thoughts to flow over him, and cleansing of the spirit. We really do feel this in the works that he's created.